The Andy Griffith Show. Starring Andy Griffith. With Ronnie Howard. Also starring Don Knox. Good morning, Carrollton High School, and welcome to your Carrollton Morning Announcements. I'm Drew Johnson. And I'm Kieran Kelly, and we are your hosts for Friday, February 26, 2024. Well, it's Monday. Uh, oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> okay. Welcome back from the break. I know it was a long break. Uh, I'm half excited to be here. I'm, I'm excited to be on the announcements. I'm excited to see my friends, but I am very tired this morning. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, but today in CHS News, students planning to take dual enrollment classes should be completing their dual enrollment packets and meeting with their counselor about summer or fall classes. Current dual enrollment students who plan on taking summer or fall dual enrollment classes also need to turn in a dual enrollment packet for returning students. Let's create a habit of checking email. If you're not checking your CHS and other email accounts daily, you're probably missing out on info and opportunities. Check your email is just as is an easy habit to create. Just set a reminder on your phone to check your email each morning and create a habit that it will keep you in the loop. Key Club will meet tomorrow, uh, February 27th at 7.45 in room D214. Pre please bring all pancake ticket money at this time. Film Club will meet again on Wednesday, February 28th in room D214 right after school. We will be watching Martin Sources Raging Bull. I've never heard of that, but you must have a permission form on this file to view this R-rated movie. Well, it's a pretty good movie. Uh, teachers remember that all 24 to 25 course recommendations are due tomorrow, uh, Monday, February 26th, which is today actually, and if at all possible, please have these completed by noon as the guidance staff will be printing individual recommended courses for students to review and advisement on Wednesday. Spanish Honor Society members must have all service hours by February 29th, which is this Thursday. You can do a bunch of things to get these hours in the next week, socks from the emergency shelter and don't to the teacher breakfast are both due on February 29th as well. So, yeah, get those in. Now over to Audrey and Eden for Trojan Sports. Here are your CHS sports announcements. Congratulations to our state champion girls wrestling team for winning the traditional state championship. <laughs> they did that right as we got off winter break. What an amazing season to Coach Newton and the wrestling staff and all the Lady Trojan wrestlers for such an amazing year. More to come from our wrestlers this week. Congratulations. A little over a week ago, the Carrollton Trojan wrestling team put an end to the wrestling season for GSHA as Jacob Levy wrestled the last match of the season, capping his junior season with another undefeated 7A state title. In addition to Levy, senior Buck Merritt, uh, sophomore Connor Stevens, and freshman Sutton White found the podium at state's largest classification, helping lead Carrollton to its highest finish in almost a decade. Ben Cleek, George Carden, Wesley Lofton, and Judah White also represented the Trojans in Macon. Coach White was extremely proud of his team effort this, this season. His thoughts on the season were that our guys continually met the high expectations that are set in front of them. They understand that once those expectations are met, then the bar moves again. This group is responsible for a good chunk of wrestling history here, and, and he is lucky to be a part of the group. Coach White was also complimentary of senior Buck Merritt, and he said he is so proud of Buck. He has been to state four times, and the first three he came up a little short, and for him to get on the podium as a senior is a testament to his hard work and dedication to the sport. Let's, let's see. And, and Coach, um, Coach White doesn't think he has wrestled his last match either. He thinks of the option to wrestle at the next level. In addition to the Trojans' sixth place finish, they won their second consecutive region titles in both dual and the traditional format. Great job, Trojan Wrestling. Congratulations also to our boys and girls basketball teams as they wrapped up the 2024 season with a tough road losses in the playoffs. Great session or great season, Trojans. Varsity boys soccer beat Northwest Whitfield this morning 3-0. Beat Whitfield 3-0 in Rome at the Northwest Georgia Showcase Tournament. Goals were scored by Isaac Cruz, Dubal Galvez, and Neil Berrios. Varsity Lady Trojans Golf opened up their season only missing a first place finish by one stroke on Saturday, finishing second at the Lady Wolves invite in the best ball event. Marissa Johnson and Adeline Laney shot a 71, and Maddie Simpson and Millie Jackson shot a 73. Varsity Baseball split this Saturday. They lost to Marietta 14-11, then rebounded to beat East Paulding 8-1. Varsity Baseball now stands at 5-2 on the young season. 
Any healthcare students who are interested in being a student athletic training aide starting during the spring football and next school year, please contact Patrick Rothschild or Shannon Bright to get an application. Rising seniors can receive a $1,500 sports medicine scholarship. This week in Trojan Sports, all of our spring sports are underway, so be sure to make your practices and stay with us for information for all of the games coming up this week. Good luck to all of our Trojan athletes. In the senior section, senior news, seniors, please scan the QR code that's around the school to submit baby pictures for the senior video. Video. These need to be submitted by March 6th. We've covered a lot of scholarship opportunities during advisement this week. If you haven't started applying for scholarships, then next week would be a great time to start. The more effort you put into your scholarship applications, the better your chances of standing out and securing financial, financial assistance for your education. Make sure you review the eligibility requirements to apply before you start. Spending time on essays only to discover you're not eligible is a time, or is time you can't get back. Check out the scholarship application strategies on the Senior Corner website. Anyone can check out the website. The Carrollton City Schools Education Foundation scholarships are due by February 28th. Contact Mrs. Gill or Mrs. Fisher if you have any questions. Contact Mrs. Fisher if you have questions about our Carrollton City Schools Community Scholarships. For information and instructions on how to apply for these scholarships and where to send your essays, visit the Guidance Career Center or email Ms. Fisher at teresa.fisher at carrolltoncityschools.net. Visit the Senior Corner website and select the scholarship link or scan the QR codes available on the cafeteria TVs. Now over to Jack for our CHS weather report. Good morning, Carrollton High School. This is your Chief Weather Reporter, Jack Wendell, with your weather update. Today's weather is calling for a forecast time of 67 and a low of 52. It will be partly cloudy during the day. CHS, welcome back. Hope everyone had a great winter break. Have a great week. Now back to our acres for today in history. Thanks, Jack. Today in history, on this day in 1919, President Woodrow Wilson, Wilson designated the Grand Canyon as a national park. The geological wonder would go on to become one of America's most popular tourist attractions. Have you ever been to the Grand Canyon? I have. It's really cool. It's yeah. bigger than you think. Oh, wow. I've never been, so I have to go at some point. need to visit it. All right. So happy birthday to some of our Kelton Trojans. First, Robert Dortch. Next, Wesley Lofton. Also, happy birthday to Sophie May Hayes, Michelle Hernandez Perez, and Zakaria Cook. Yeah. The SAT word of the week is inherent, as used on the SAT, inborn and built in. And as used in a sentence, the Grand Canyon has an inherent beauty. Yes, that yes. is very true. But remember, opportunity starts here. So make the most of today's opportunity. That's all for us this morning. Thank you for watching the Carrollton Morning Announcements. We hope you have a marvelous Monday and, and go, go Trojans! Trojans.